Celebrate 75 years of joy with this new edition featuring more than 4,000 recipes, classic and new. Welcome to a whole new generation of joy. The holidays and cookies are inseparable, and Joy of Cooking is a wealth of cookie inspiration. If we could pick just one reason to love the 75th anniversary edition, it's this cookie recipe, the most versatile around. This recipe begins with a basic dough made from butter, sugar, a dash of salt, eggs, vanilla, and flour. Here we have the basic dough that we've let chill in the refrigerator. This disc is a third of the dough. You'll want to work with one disc at a time. We have the oven preheating to 350 degrees. Make sure to preheat the oven 20 minutes before baking. To shape the cookies, either form the dough into one tablespoon balls and place on a cookie sheet about two inches apart. Then, using the flour-coated smooth bottom of a glass or glass bowl, flatten each ball to about an eighth of an inch thick. Or, roll the dough to an eighth of an inch thick. Cut into shapes and arrange about an inch apart. And now they're ready to bake. After the cookies are golden brown, about 8 to 10 minutes in a 350 degree oven, move them to a wire rack to cool completely. After they're cool, either ice or leave plain. Now that we have our base, possibilities abound. For marble cookies, add melted chocolate to half the dough and then combine the two halves to create a marbled look. Or, you can make a quick change to tangy lemon butter cookies simply by adding lemon zest along with the vanilla. And from there, add poppy seeds to the finished dough for lemon poppy seed cookies. It just goes on and on, and all from one basic dough. And with the ideas and recipes found here, you'll have all you need to start spreading some holiday cheer of your own. Here's wishing you and yours the joy of the season and the joy of cookies, courtesy of Joy of Cooking.